And all the chicken they my try for spy. Is which one of them is going to fry? Hello, good day. I am Chef Williams, and I'll be showing you today how we'll be preparing a picnic ham. Now, first thing, we're going to remove it from the plastic bag because I've seen people cooking it in the plastic bag, and trust me, people, it doesn't work that way. So, you remove it from the plastic bag. <laughs> Place it in your baking pan. Now what you really need to do is add a bit of water to this because it will stick and burn if you don't have some moisture to help cook it. I'm going to throw at least two cups of water in this baking pan. Simple and easy as that. And that's the first step to start steaming off your arm. Next, start your oven up, put it at 350, you preheat and then you move on, when it comes up, you put your arm in. It's almost there, so you can put your arm in and close them up. Now our arm of that size is approximately 3.96 kgs, at least 8 pounds. This will take at least 15 minutes per pound. 15 times 8 there is approximately 4 hours within that range. So we're going to use at least 4 hours to steam that off. After that, then we're going to do the finishing product. Okay? So, be right back. Okay, and we are back. Now, what we'll be doing is removing the skin from the arm gently. You can just let it cool down a little bit before you do that. Add some cores to that. You can add some cloves if you wish, or if you don't like cloves, no problem. A little mustard is good. So just give you a little moisture, a little flavor, and more flavors are always good for you. We use a bit of cinnamon sugar, which is about um, half a cup of cinnamon to a tablespoon, half a cup of sugar to a tablespoon of cinnamon, sorry. And you put that back in the oven to finish off. There you go. Now, after we're finished with that, we'll be dressing the ham with a little pineapple, cherries, and a little parsley. Okay, now your ham is golden brown and beautiful, just ready for eating. But before you start to eat, we need to just garnish and let your ham be more pleasant to the eyes. And you can just garnish this up with a little cherry, pineapples, you can just use some toothpicks to fasten this to your meat. There you go. A nice, well garnished arm for your Christmas. And all the chicken day, my tribe is pie. This is what you